Looking to do some hunting, eh? Staying safe, I hope. We'll pay whatever it takes, but we must have more swords for the Imperial soldiers. I just can't fill an order that size on my own. Why don't you swallow that stubborn pride of yours and ask Jorland Greymane for help? <laughs> I'd sooner bend my knee to Ulfric's Stormcloak. Besides, Greymane would never make steel for the Legion. Have it your way. I'll take the job, but don't expect a miracle. Damn those Greymanes to oblivion. They want to back the Stormcloaks, they'll get what's coming to them. Greymane or Battleborn? Got stones in your ears? I asked what side you're on. Greymane or Battleborn? New in town, huh? White Run's got two clans, both old and both respected. Difference is, the Greymanes turned their backs on the Empire, and we Battleborn stayed loyal. So I'll ask again, Grey Mane or Battleborn? Then I say, well met, friend. I could tell you were a sharp one the moment I laid eyes on you. Long live the Empire. I mostly deal with petty thievery and drunken brawls. Been too long since we've had a good bandit raid. Storm cloaks, Imperials, Jargons. Ain't no matter to me what I kill. Let them come. Trouble? I'd be a lot warmer and a lot happier with a belly full of mead. Staying safe, I hope. Thinking of settling in? There's a house for sale. I used to be an adventurer like you. Then I took an arrow in the knee. Staying out of trouble, kinsman. Touching by your armor, I'd say you're an Imperial Scout. If so, well met. I ain't asking for much, just a few seconds. Thinking I need to train some more. I... What? Why are you looking at me? Oh, thank you. Divines bless your kind heart. Only if I can help it. But damn if I ain't almost sober. Hey, in the Bannered Mare, there's this bottle of Argonian Ale. The good stuff. Get it for me. They won't even know it's gone. Come on. Argonian ale. I can almost taste it. Sure, whatever.
Oh, Lord, like again. Trouble? Disrespect the law and you disrespect me. Everything's all right. Disrespect the law and you disrespect me. I know your family's honor is important to you, but we can't afford it. It took me weeks to find that thief's death. My I can't stop the now. Finest but I can't get the sword on my own. And so you're willing to starve your wife and daughter thing. to reclaim some rusty old sword? I just need to hire one, maybe two good men. You won't starve. I'll put it plainly. You can claim your sword, or you can keep your wife. If you set foot outside that gate, I won't be here when you return. You tried mercenary work? Sometimes I miss the soldier's life, but when I hold my daughter in my arms, I know I made the right choice. My sapphire doesn't like that I've been spending so much time looking for my father's old sword. He fed his entire family with the gold he made using that weapon. I'm not about to let it gather dust in some thief's trophy room. I tracked it to a group of bandits nearby, but I'm no fool. I'd need the White Run guards or maybe hire the companions to get it. I don't know why I'm saying this, but if you find it out in your travels, I'd be grateful to you. I can teach you a few things. No, friend. That, I'm not. But I get along with your kind well enough. No, I'm a Red Guard. My family hails from the Imperial Province. Ah, but I left home when I was just a lad. Been wandering ever since. If you find that... Saphir! Wait, I... Imperials, Jargons, it no matter to me what I kill. Let them come. I'm the commander of the guard here in Whiterun. Huh? You look tired, friend. The bannered mare has beds for rent. Thinking of settling in? There's a house for sale, Breeze Hall. You should talk to the steward up in the keep if you're interested.
Take a good look around. I'm sure you'll find what you're looking for. If not, let me know. I might have it stored away. Please do... Look around. I'm sure I have something you'll want. Everything's for sale, my friend. Everything. If I had a sister, I'd sell her in a second. Do come back. I'd even buy one of your relatives if you're looking to sell. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's, that's a little joke. Interesting, to say the least. What with all that's been going on. On the one hand, supplies are harder to come by since fewer traders are traveling the roads these days. But on the other, the scarcity of supplies has led to some, well, elevated prices. All that matters is that I have what you need, and it's worth every septum. Some may call this junk. Me, I call them treasures. Isn't it obvious? Why, the wonderful weather and hospitable people, of course. Not to mention my great fondness for dragons and petty political power struggles. Ah, but without a doubt, the most compelling feature of this frozen wasteland is the volley of inane questions leveled at me on a regular basis. Remember, I'll give you the best deals or die trying. You just let me know what you need. Welcome to Bellathor's Some may call this junk. Me, I call them treasures. Do come back. It's for sale, my friend. You need visit no other shops today. Come to chat with an old woman, hmm? Do your good deed for the day. Is he nothing? So don't talk to me about stuff. Your son chose his side, and he chose for him. Ah, hello, my Nord friend. In the market for some hunting supplies? Try Holda, the innkeeper at the Bannered Mare. It's just up the road near the market. You should check in at Dragon's Reach, too. There's so much going on these days. The Jarl or his steward might have need of help. Yes, I hear that question often. My brother Anorieth and I came up with it one night after consuming... rather too much mead. After our drinks, 
we went out for a moonlight hunt. We got separated, and in his drunken state, my brother mistook me for a deer. He shot an arrow that pierced my... well, rump. After such a memorable adventure, we knew we had the name for our shop. An archer, eh? I've got just what you need. An archer, eh? I've got just what you need. Thank you very much for your business. Ulfred, patron of the great clan Battleborn, a name I'm sure you know well. Just one more thing the Grey Manes want to blame on others. It's not my fault they turned their backs on the Empire, or their mule of a son raised arms against it. And yet, they want to heap the fault on my family's good name? Ha! You watch yourself out there. Blade and shadow, silence and death. These are my arts. For a modest fee. I'll make great art for you. I know nothing of fear, and nothing of remorse. Pay my fee, and together we will vanquish any foe.